If you get this error message in Astronia, which say failed to connect to host, and in most cases it occurs when you try to play multiplayer with your friend, then I will guide you on how to resolve this problem. So listen to this tutorial very carefully. Now the failed to connect to host issue in Astronia is common and usually network related. If you go to various forums like Microsoft and Reddit, you can see a lot of people are complaining regarding this issue. I even joined the Astronia Discord to look for answers regarding this problem and some useful advice has been shared here. So I'll also share with you which this advice which has been provided on their Discord and through various forums. I'll also share with you on how to fix this problem which say failed to connect to host in Astronia. Now the first thing you need to do is disconnect from your internet and reconnect. Then try again. If that doesn't work, restart your computer. Make sure you have a stable internet connection as instability can cause the game to disconnect. Try sending the invite again. You just have to keep trying several times and check if it works. Or maybe if you've tried several times, but you're still facing again the same issue. Now check your router. Make sure your NAT type is open. You do this by enabling UPnP on your router settings. This has to be done for both of you. Now check your router. Make sure your NAT type is open. You do this by enabling UPnP on your router settings. This has to be done for both of you who you're trying to play multiplayer on this game. Now, maybe if you've done so, but you're still facing again the same issue. Now, luckily, Microsoft has provided a troubleshooting guide for multiplayer issues on your PC. So just try to follow these instructions very carefully. I'll also provide this page on the description. You can just click on this description for this video and refer to this page here so that you can follow easily. Now, maybe if you're using Windows 10, now listen to this very carefully. If you can't connect to Xbox multiplayer game on Windows 10, go to Settings, select Gaming, select Xbox Networking. Look for Server Connectivity. If the status says blocked, your PC was unable to establish a Teredo IPC connection to the quality of service server. If you also see Teredo is unable to qualify next to NAT type, visit the Teredo, Teredo troubleshooting page first to fix the problem. Just go to this page here, which says NAT type on Windows Display, Teredo, Teredo is unable to qualify. Now, if you're using Windows 11, just follow the instructions here. If you're having a similar problem on Windows 11, select the window key here, which is this one. Now, go to Settings, select Network and Internet, select Advanced Network Settings, select Network Reset and Reset Now. Now, this will try to reset your network connections. Now, if you've done so but you're still facing again the same issue, there are some troubleshooting guides you need to follow, like this one which says make sure you have an internet connection, make sure Windows Defender Firewall is enabled and that the default policy is active. Now, there are various instructions here which I can't go through all this. I'll provide this page on the description so that you can try one by one to see if it can help you resolve this issue. But the main one which I have seen on the forums and on their Discord is this one which you can try to follow these instructions and it can help you resolve this issue. Just try to disconnect your internet and reconnect it. Then try again. If that doesn't work, restart your PC. Make sure you have a stable internet connection as instability can cause the game to disconnect. Try sending the invite again. You just have to keep trying several times and check if it works. Also check your router. Make sure your NAT type is open. You do this by enabling UPnP on your router settings. This has to be done for both of you. Now, if you've tried several times but you're still facing again the same issue, the best way is to contact Astronia support team and they will guide you on how to resolve this issue. The contact us page will be available on the description or you can just join their discord and you'll find useful information from there.